Hey Jose, this is the video that Anthony told you we put together going over what you can do to increase your online presence and your customer basis. I know you might be wondering why we do something like this, but honestly, when businesses like yours are out pursuing your business, you neglect your online presence. And if you happen to be aware of how important online presence is, then you've hired someone and those guys didn't do their job and they didn't give you the results you were looking for, so you don't want to hire anyone again. So what we realize is that when we put together videos like these and we go over exactly what you need to do to see a turnaround in the next 30 days with your customers, Businesses come back and say, oh my gosh, I cannot believe you did this. Thank you so much. We can't do this. Can you help us please? And of course we oblige. So if at the end of the video you realize that there's a lot that we could teach you and a lot of value we can add, then there's going to be a link for Anthony's email. Hit that schedule an appointment to sit down and go over what you're looking to do in the future with your business. So without further ado, I'm going I'm to start with what I'm going to teach you about today. Three dynamic tips that if you apply, you will see for sure a change in your customer basis. So number one of those being content. I like your website. Excellent choice in the slideshow. It's either a slideshow or a video when people come to their web pages. This is what gets user. Um, exp this is called UI UX or user um, experience. So the video at the top, amazing job. Videos here, videos here, great, great interaction on the front page of your site. Excellent job. What I notice, you guys do not have fifteen hundred words. Fifteen hundred words is what Google sees as minimum as your site having knowledge or value that needs to be given to the world. And so they'll rank you up higher if you have at minimum 1500 words. I checked out your competitor. These guys are getting searched 480 times a month with the term uh, plumbing Tacoma, right? That's 480 opportun 80 opportunities that they're not coming to your site in order for you to even convert a percentage of that into clients. 480, pe 480 people come to your site will make a, a heck of a difference in your monthly income for sure. The one thing I noticed on their site is just like you guys, they don't have 1500 words, which means that we can come in here and we optimize your site and dominate them in the content portion. Next, I want to cover citations. So what are citations? Citations are an online directory where you're going to place your business name, your business phone number, and your business address. Some of those locations even allow you to add your website, which will give you site authority. And I'll discuss that in 30 seconds. So citations, places you can list your citations or you can be listed as a citation are um, Facebook, which is new, uh, White Pages, Yellow Pages, MapQuest, uh, Easy Local, those type places. Anytime you do that, you're getting your business verified. The more places your business is verified, the more Google will trust you. The more they trust you, the more that when you get ready to do your Google My Business listing, they're going to rank you higher than anyone else because you're a verified source. So that's something that we need to do. I know you might be wondering, well, why? I see ads above. That's before that. Well, that's wasted money because 73,000 people are searching every month how to block those things. You don't, you don't have to believe me. You can search it yourself and you can see what type of results you get from running an ad. It's probably not going to be worth the bang for the buck. However, doing it organically, that's free. Why not monopolize on what's free in order to get you the most advertising? So last, backlinks. Backlinks are, in a short summary, a hyperlink from one site to another site that connects users. So if I'm on a blog, I'm reading about soap, there's a link that says something about soap, I click on the link and it goes to a soap distributor, then that's called a backlink. What they did was send traffic via a hyperlink on their site to my site and they shared their site authority with me. So Google saw that sharing of site authority and said, man, I must be a trustworthy website because this highly rated site trusts me enough to link to my site specifically. So when I come in here and I see that you guys got 21 backlinks, I got to tell you kudos because your domain rating is strong for only 21 backlinks and eight referring domains. I will say your organic keywords need to be improved for you to have 39 organic keywords. Then I should be seeing you ranking at least with 39 people coming to your site for organic traffic. This tells me we're not max, we're not ranking it like we should be for the keywords that we need. So you got a lot of keywords that get high search volume, but you're in like the fifth page of Google for it. So you're, this is the eighth, ninth, and 10th page. So you're missing out on all the traffic. That's why you don't have any coming to it. But for the ones you notice that you're ranked on the front page, even down to the third page, you're getting some traffic to. So I checked out your competitor because I wanted you to see what it was like. These guys have way more backlinks than you guys, but their trust rating because of the, the quality of their backlinks is fail. It's, it's suffering. So 
if you honestly wanted to do anything with backlinks, you could, but you don't you don't really have to because yours is so strong. What we care about are your organic keywords. And in order for us to get you ranked for those organic organic keywords, we need to optimize the content on your website. And then we need to make sure that the category of the backlinks that you have are strong enough to continue to hold you over against your competitor. So I realized this was a lot to try and compile in five minutes, and I hope that I was able to get tremendous amounts of value added to you. If you realize that there's so much more that we could teach you and help you to grow your business, then hit the link below this video to message Anthony and set up a time for you guys to go over how, what, how to move your company forward um, in the next year. If not, and you want to apply these tools that I've given you yourself, there's no problem with that whatsoever. All we ask for is some feedback on the value you got from the video. If it was helpful, if there are things we need to change, because all we want to do is continue serving small business like yours to see them prosper in the future. Thank you so much. We can't wait to hear from you.